Yo, what's going on guys? JBH here and today I'm back on R Factor 2 continuing on with this sort of Grand Prix of Indianapolis weekend I've got going on. Yesterday we competed in the USF 2000 Cup, whereas today I am moving up in the Road to Indy to the Indy Pro 2000 category where we're going to be seeing what the PM18 is like. Now I did actually used to race in the what used to be called the Pro Mazda category in real life. So I drove a lot of what was the Star Mazda race car, which was the precursor to the PM18. I never got to drive the PM18 in real life but it's going to be interesting to see what it is like on R Factor 2 since we have a pretty realistic rendition of the PM18. Now the mod itself doesn't have any skins or well real life skins or real life drivers it has a couple baseline skins uh, but yeah for the most part it is looking like a pretty realistic version and yeah without any further ado we'll jump straight into this qualifying session and get underway. Alrighty so qualifying is run and done we qualified 13th out of 15 and although we're way down the back I was only like three tenths off the pole so the field is pretty close or the AI is is pretty close around here this race is 20 minutes which is exactly uh half of what it is in the real life sort of road to indie races the difficulty i've had to turn it down a bit because this uh well this set of ai for this mod are pretty good so it's at 100 percent right now damage at max uh, AI aggression at 40% and I think I set the AI limiter to zero. So without any further ado, we'll set away on this formation lap. Of course, it is a rolling start as is, well, virtually every uh, series in America or open wheel or sports car series in America. Anyway, here we go, Indy Pro 2000 around the Indianapolis Motor Speedway road course. Let's see if we can all survive turn one. Turn one here is always a mess in real life. Do I die bomb? I died bomb, no I don't want to, uh, but I'm going to do it anyway, oh don't hit me, don't hit me, oh, that's a nasty curb, three wide, ah, squeeze, right. love me some of that, can we hold it, can we hold it, oh, big check up through the chicane, Right, well, we've made a couple of spots. Ah, oh, damn it. <laughs> he did exactly what I was going to do. Uh, Should have gone the other side. Gutsy move. <laughs> Alright, get onto the straight. Definitely one of the longest straights in the Road to Indy calendar, so for this very straight you have the wings flattened out. Alright, now for some draft. Though these cars don't really punch that big of a hole in the air, so we're getting a little bit, but we're on the rev limiter. <laughs> Unfortunately you can't change the gearing in this car. You either want to be <laughs> at the left or the right side of that curb, you do not want to be on the middle of it. Or else you ruin the floor like I just managed to do. Right, come on, got to find a way past these guys. We're up into eight, so we've gained five spots so far. before the braking zone, come on, let's go, crap he's got a draft as well, oh this is not going to end well, yeah you do, you do the hard work, I'll just hopefully get both of you, oh around the outside, no, oh Jesus, no, 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 oh followed him off the track, oh someone's gone around, no. Come on. 
Oh, well, that's set us back. Alright, not to worry. We're only five seconds behind. Oh, Jesus. AI's had a big moment there. Alright, <laughs> the comeback's on. We're only a quarter of the way through the race. I did say that wasn't going to end well, and sure enough. I hate these types of curbs. You get too much of them and it just drags you off the track. We're not in last. Ugh, idiot. I was too worried about the guy that was alongside me. I felt like I was gonna flick off of him by being able to build contact with someone. Always got to be careful passing a car when there's a, another car directly in front. Oh, jeez. Screw that up. You don't want to overshoot and then take that guy in front out. Oh my god, dude, what the f fucking Jesus. Why are they checking up so much? Right, well, I think we still have a front wing. No. Oh. <laughs> Just made all that ground up. Oh, I hate the AI. AI on this game sometimes. Uh, it's not gone well. Starting to lose some grip. I have spun twice, so struggling with this tire. I've sort of warped them a little bit too much, I think. Uh, 
every last bit of those curbs. Now, I did actually used to compete in the Pro Mazda, well, Pro Mazda category, which was sort of the precursor to this, before they changed its name when Mazda sort of dropped out of the whole Mazda Road to Indy. Hence why it's now Indy Pro 2000. Oh, come on, keep it together. Uh, but yeah, it's a shame I never got to drive this car. It does look pretty insane. fun sort of fact about it the um, well when they first brought out Tatus brought out the new well it's not really new any year four years old USF 2000 car they were sort of in the process of sorting this Indy Pro 2000 car for their following year and um, ended up just basically taking the British Formula 4 car rebranding it putting some different wings on it and saying there you go Although it's then, you know, Pro Mazda 18 labelled car, it's really just a Formula 3 car from Great Britain. Are they using the exact same series? Or exact same car in two different series, I should say. Oh, I just can't make any inroads. I've lost the grip of the tyre. cut tracks. Just can't keep up the same pace. We have pace, it's just not consistent. And we're too far back. Stupid mistakes. Bar change. That was wrong button. I haven't got a button mapped. Damn it. What have we got left? Seven minutes. This guy's gonna lunch me in a second.
Alright, well that was a better lap. Five minutes to try and catch this pack ahead. It means we need to sort of gain a second a lap, which I can't see us doing. And then need him to start making some sort of mistakes. That was a better lap again. Definitely catching these guys, just don't have enough time left on the clock. That was a much slower lap, but still slowly catching them. Three minutes left, come on. Ah, no. Dude, stop fighting, we gotta go to the front. Half a second, Jesus. Time 
remaining one minute. It's probably going to be the last lap. Well, not this one, but the one after. Right, we got held up big time on that lap. Okay, this is the final lap, but not close enough to make any more spots. Sort of goes to show, and it is quite realistic in that, you know, you make any tiny mistake in these types of races in these categories and you are done for. You really have to have an almost perfect race. Oh, come on. Worn out the last of these tyres. Still good on the numbers but I can definitely feel it. Oh, one had a mistake. I must admit, although it wasn't a very fun race in the end, it was really good to drive this car for the first time, or drive this mod. I do really like this car, this car's a load of fun, but anyway that's that, check the flag is out, you will have to deal with a 14th place finish. Made it up to 8th on the start, but then just screwed up. Oop, and we're just going to completely wipe him out. Alrighty, well, that's that. Uh, <laughs> thanks, guys, for tuning in. I hope you guys enjoyed, well, for the most part, what was a good race at the start. Uh, yeah, we're going to hit up the Indie Light Series tomorrow and see the, what that car's like for the first time, and then move on to the actual Indy Car Series uh, in two days' time and run that race. But yeah, until then, I'll catch you guys later.